So Rebecca Sachs then and her colleagues have studied the role of this right temporal parietal junction for thinking about others, theory of mind. And they've also found that that same part of the brain, that right temporal parietal junction, is also very active in what's called exogenous attention. Sounds like a big word, but all it means is attention to things other than you. So attention to space around me would be exogenous, but also attention to what, what's going on around me, not paying attention to me. Not, it's not about how I feel. It's not about how, what I want. How are you doing? And what do you want? And what's going on around me? And when I'm being asked to pay attention to the world around me, or when I have to, then the right temporal parietal junction seems to be activated. And then we have the top of the temporal lobe in the right hemisphere. And that's the right superior temporal sulcus. Remember, sulcus is groove, gyrus is bump. So in the temporal lobe, we have a bump at the top of the temporal lobe that's the right superior temporal gyrus. And underneath that is the groove, the right superior temporal sulcus. In the left hemisphere, the left superior temporal sulcus is very important for speech sound perception in its Wernicke's area. Um, and so attaching sound to meaning. But in the right hemisphere, according to Rebecca Sachs's research, it's very important to understanding the actions of others, reading other people by watching them, by looking at how they move. You can tell, if I just do this, you can tell without me saying a word that I seem to be coming down and I seem not too happy. You can tell just by my posture if I do this. I don't even smile. I don't have to do anything. That I'm confident, that I'm energetic, that I'm motivated. It's the movement. And paying attention to that tells you a lot about a person. So I might be walking down the street and somebody might say something wrong. And I'll go, oh, no. And they'll say, oh, you just look like you were really sad. You're frowning. And oh, I'm sorry. People are paying, I didn't say a word to that person, but they just identified that movement. 